Okay, I know in the last video we made that. But now this video, I'm thinking I should show you how I go about on making journaling cards and stuff for this. You're probably thinking, oh, this is review. But you know what? There's always new people. And not everybody knows. So... We got three book pages that I folded already. Them, that's already glued. This we can glue quick. Not a big deal. There. Quickly glued. We're just cutting off some of this. This one, I just want to make it a little tiny bit shorter, just so it looks like it's a straight line. Okay. And this one, all I'm doing is cutting off that part, and that's it. All right. And... The one I did with the dictionary paper was the background for this one. So I was thinking, why don't we use dictionary paper for the three of them? So that's what I'm going to do. That like took the whole, the huge chunk of glue. Let's smooth that glue around here. All right. You know what? That's what I don't care if it's sideways. It's just background. This looks really uneven. Let's just straighten that there. Just a little bit too uneven for my liking. All right. Oops.
All right. We got our three cards, journaling cards here. No. Just thinking. Let's just give them some backing right away. So I just, right now I'm just doing the basic, back it, put it on something right away. There. <clears throat> we got two out of the three. And the rest of it's gonna just go with my scraps over here. That I seem to be making a nice scrap pile out of. And that can go in there too. All right. That fits actually pretty close to perfect. Let's just use this side. Or one. There we go. Or three. No. I'm gonna want some pretties in here. I'm just fussy. Hang around this part because I think that would be pretty on here. It really would. So that's what I'm going to do there. Um, I'm going to add a cute little butt or piece right there too I'm just wondering is if I have something that would look cool that would look cool on there all right storm must be starting. Yeah, I know it's weird I'm saying a storm must be starting because it's, <laughs> you can start hearing noises from outside like a storm starting. Mm -hmm. 
Sometimes they work good as labels, sometimes not. Ooh, that looks cute as a label though. That's just a cutout index card. I like that. Okay. That's how I'm going to do it. I'm going to move this this way so I can use it for my gluing here. Yeah, I gave up on using my white glue for a little while. I was getting annoyed with it. And I have this kind of glue that I just need to use up. before it goes bad, so. That's my plan at the moment. Yeah, I really like that. It just gives it that look. Like a label-ish look without so much label. I think what I used, this is what I used, okay. This is what I used for the side, and I was thinking just to save some time here. So nicer just to staple it on. Staples all the way through. Oops, I forgot to distress it though. <laughs> I don't distress everything, which makes it more difficult when I do need to distress things. To remember, oh yeah, I need to distress this. Because I don't always distress. So, there we go. And this one's going to be the one that goes behind. I know it's weird that I made it like this. Well, I suppose it could still go behind. Like a belly band. But you're not really going to see it. So, we'll just do that. It'll work out. In the end. There. That's all grungy up. And this one's all grungy up. Now this one, I really would like this on there, and then I definitely want this guy just hiding in there. Maybe hide up here, yeah. And then let's add some more little things inside just to give it a little bit more of an added look. Yeah, like each of these are kind of like a pocket within a pocket that looks kind of cool um, I'm just wondering if there's something else we could pass in there Ooh. yeah so I'm just gonna make this into a po three separate pockets I know that seems a little crazy why would I do that Why not? Hmm. 
that is actually a great idea. I use my tickets to make itty bitty pockets for stuff like this. It's so thin. There we go. And then again, we'll add a little bit of this to the top. As a topper, actually, as a side topper, is what I should say. Because now we're going to stick this in this pocket right here. If I made it correctly. Yeah, I did. Okay. So. It's completely hidden. So I guess this would make work if I really wanted to like this, but I still think it'd look better like this. My daughters are supposed to be in bed right now. I'm very sure that isn't what's happening. That paper clip is not going to work. Do I have any more in here? Just looking to see what all I have in this. Ooh, there we go. That's what I was thinking of. Just a cute little pink paper clip. And then... Grab this. Go on this side of it. And I stapled it on. And then this is just going to tuck. That's why I grabbed the paper clip. Just tuck right in there. So that's how it looks in the end. I know I used a lot of this ruffle, but I just, I thought the ruffle makes it all coincide then. So, yeah. So now we got the one journaling card here. We got another tag here. And we got another tag here. It's all ready to go. And I just realized we're gonna have to, gonna have to do it this way <laughs> in order for it not to look like it's backwards. Okay. So again, uh, it's just something different. I'm just gonna slip this there just so I can keep it all together. It don't really matter where it's stuck on here at all because. Again, I'm just trying to keep it together. Or even, actually, I could just do this. There we go. Alright. And then this is going to go in with my other pockets and stuff. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please go to Etsy. My Hope Craft Shop. I have quite a few journals that... And sometimes I de-stash in there. I'll de-stash stuff like my little ruffles that I make like this that are very shabby looking. 
I also am planning, I have digitals in it, I am also planning to be putting some fabric pockets and I'm planning on doing a project with you guys about making these little fabric pockets of mine that I have sitting here. This is the triple pocket that Irene, Crafty Arena did, but I love this because it's fabric form. Instead of using paper, I used fabric for the entire thing. I was fiddling around one day and I just decided to make one out of fabric. And it's actually, I think, much thinner than the paper one. Because fabric is thinner than paper, so. These will be, or different types like this is going to be out in my Etsy shop soon. Different fabrics. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe, and have a great day or night. Bye.